Hey, it's Matt. I'm the director of marketing at Aptopia. And in this video, I'm going to give you a quick overview of Aptopia's ad intelligence platform. Let's dive in. So I've already logged into Aptopia, pulled open the ad intelligence section. Let's take a quick look. So uh, to show you guys real world data, I'm going to take a look at Angry Birds 2. Click into that. Awesome. One important note, ad intelligence is just one small component of the, all the data that uh, we collect or that's available from Aptopia. We have everything from download and usage information to revenue, statistics, retention, uh, even demographics on the users of any given app. So I've loaded Advertiser Insights. Let's walk through this. Uh, right off the bat, you have the ability to filter this by market and by time frame. Um, and the very first insight that we show you are the breakdown or breakdown by network share. So uh, what networks make up the largest percentage of this advertiser's impressions? Um, so uh, we can see looking at this chart, the vast majority are ad colony um, and it's supported to a lesser extent by Vungle. So about 25 to 30% ad colony and then another 1% or so through Vungle. The next thing we show you we're going to actually show you the apps uh, that Angry Birds 2 is actually showing ads on. Um, so we can see right off the bat that they've been showing ads on PhotoGrid. Uh, not sure what the tail end of that app is, but we've been, they've been showing apps on PhotoGrid for roughly 41 weeks. Uh, and we'll actually show you how that uh, share of impressions has changed over time. So whether it's 7 days, 30 days, etc. Taking it a step further, we're actually going to show you the creatives that Angry Birds 2 is running on these various apps. So uh, I have this sorted by percentage of impressions. So let's cl click into one of these. We can see that, yep, Advertiser's Angry Birds 2. No surprise. Uh, it's a video type. Uh, the network uh, used to show this is Ad Colony, which no surprise since we saw that earlier makes up roughly 12 or 13% of the impressions. Uh, and this particular ad's been running 41 weeks. We can also actually just play that. There are a couple other tools within Aptopia that, would, that we should take a look at as well. So let's take a look. So our spend tool essentially shows you um, the ad budget that you would need to spend to achieve a particular rank for your app. So let's take a look again at the Angry Birds 2 example. Games, analyze. Okay, so uh, Angry Birds 2 is currently ranked 70. It's ranged between 49 and 80 and it hasn't changed any over the last 24 hours. I'm going to go ahead and pick a rank that we want to achieve. Let's say 11. We're at 70 now. So for us to move from rank 70 over here to rank 11, we would need roughly 6,000 additional downloads and roughly $15,000 in ad spend. We also show you how to distribute your ad spend to maintain that rank uh, over the next few days. Because um, again, it's not like ad spend's evenly distributed. Sometimes you're going to want to front load it. Um, and we're basically giving you recommendations on how to do that. The next tool I want to show you guys, and again, this is all within our ad intelligence suite, is Aptopia's Maximize tool. What Aptopia's Maximize tool does is it takes your app, compares it to your competitors, and essentially shows you the markets in which your competitors are, uh, or the mid-tier markets in which your competitors are having a lot of success. So for this example, let's use some popular dating apps. I'm going to pick Tinder. Let's say we have $20,000 to spend. Um, let's compare it with OkCupid and maybe Match.com. Awesome. Going to click Maximize. Perfect. So uh, what it's showing you are the countries, Germany, Switzerland, and Denmark, in which OkCupid and Match.com have actually uh, had high return or high ARPU. So essentially what you're getting are the mid-tier markets that your competitors have already had success in that you are currently missing out on. Um, and then we actually break down that budget by country uh, and we give you an idea of kind of what uh, some of those common metrics look like. So kind of lifetime value, 30-day retention in ARPU. And then we break down uh, the percentage of budget in the actual dollar amount. 
Awesome. Uh, so this has been a quick demo of Aptopia's Ad Intelligence tool. Again, this is just one portion of the data that we make available. If this is the type of thing that's interesting to you, uh, we'd love to walk you through a one-on-one -on -one demo and actually tailor it to your own use case. Uh, you can reach out to humans at aptopia.com uh, or just visit our website. Uh, we're here to help.